Hi, this is Zisa with Amajuicer.com, and today I want to take a minute to show you how to juice. You may have seen some of my other juicing videos, but today is going to be a juicing recipe for kale, carrots, and apple. It's one of my favorite, and my kids love it. Uh, I did a demonstration at the high school uh, Friday, and the kids there, I'd say 90% loved it. So uh, don't let the color scare you. The greens are wonderful for you. These kale is full of vitamins, uh, antioxidants. Uh, this type of food puts oxygen in your body. And when you have oxygen in your body, it's hard for a disease like cancer to grow. So you want to put lots of fresh vegetables in your body because it's full of enzymes, vitamins, minerals, and oxygen. And it helps to detox your body and what that really means is that it's flushing out the bad stuff so uh, why do we have aches and pains usually it's from inflammation inflammation is caused from really eating an unhealthy lifestyle or having an unhealthy lifestyle eating uh, things that are processed and fried and uh, just bad oils um, and white flour so juicing helps if you're not eating a whole healthy lifestyle, it still helps because it still gives you those, it's like putting an IV in of uh, dense nutrition. So here we go. I'm going to juice. I'm going to turn this on high. This is a Breville. It's a great juicer. It's on my website, imajuicer.com. And go into the products tab, and it happens to be the least expensive one. I think it's around 170 uh, but it works great, and then they go on up to $530, the Green Star, which is really a good juicer, too. Uh, you can juice wheatgrass through that one. It's a little bit more expensive, but it'll last you a lifetime. Uh, so here we go. Uh, by the way, this is a, uh, they're all masticating juicers on imajuicer.com. I've researched them, and uh, the... I have three juicers and a wheatgrass juicer, and they all work fabulous. So, take a peek. Here we go. Definitely want to wash them really well with some soapy uh, water, or you can use a, a soap that's just for fruits and veggies. Um, if you go to uh, Corinne's, uh, I'm going to get you that on my website. Go to imajuicer.com and under products, there'll be a tab on where to get the uh, wash. You'll love it. It's all natural. Uh, Corinne, she's a local lady here that makes it, and uh, it's worth getting. But if you don't have that, just Use your uh, soap from your sink. Here it is. I just squirt a little bit of this in here. And it uh, comes out foamy. And just make sure you wash your fruits and veggies off really well. Okay, we'll finish this up. Have a delicious juice. <laughs>
on for a little bit longer. Let all the juice get out of there. Oh, I like to get every drop because it's so delicious and so good for us. So you stir it well, just like that. And, oh, I have to get a cup of this. You have to taste this delicious juice. Mm. And I'll save some. My kids will love it. Uh, the, this pitcher is so nice, you can just pour right out of here. But you just have to be careful. If you tip this pitcher over too far, uh, this lid comes out. And it just spills all over. So you kind of have to be careful about that. It's almost better to take that off of there while you're pouring. Mmm. Oh, it is so, so good. Mmm. The other thing I want to remind you is when you're in the kitchen cooking, people are always asking me, what kind of exercise tips do you have? I don't go to a gym. I just do everything in my home. So when you're waiting for the water to boil or waiting for the... Uh, uh, the meat to broil, stand at the counter, do some leg lifts. Just stand there and get those legs in the air. You'll be amazed. You may hurt back here tomorrow, but that's a good thing. Those glute muscles, make sure glute muscles tight, and uh, do about 10 of them on each leg. And get your hands in the air. And just bend your knees a little bit, make your core tight, and just stand there and get your hands in the air. And just pull down like you're resisting something and just pull down. You'll be surprised at what muscles you're using and how tight they'll, they'll, they'll firm up. Um, and like I said, if you're a little sore, that's okay, but don't forget to drink your water. And, oh, it'd be fabulous if you're not juicing to start juicing. Go to imajuicer.com. I have lots of good information on there about uh, how to juice, of course, recipes, I'm getting a, a new recipe book on there, a juicing recipe. You'll love it, so go and look that up. Good videos. Um, I'm going to be doing interviews of other doctors and specialists with information that I want to share with you and, uh, and free webinars. So come see us at imajuicer.com and sign up for my free newsletters. See you there. Bye-bye.